This is the review on the T1211 soldering station sent over by PhoneFix as a gift to review. We're just going to be doing an unboxing and we're going to be doing a demonstration. Hisham will be doing a demonstration on the different tips, etc. Comes with tips included, which is really nice. Three tips. Three tips. Power cord. And head holder. Wow. It feels good. Feels very good. And the manual. And this is the little box. It's actually it's big. Oh, it's heavy, eh? Let's check it out. There's only... 13. Let's... Let's give it a plug in and... Here we go. And also, the way how they set up this is very smart. Careful, boss. It's going to come out again. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> Let's take it off. There we go. And it's quite spudgy. So, it's a feel. It's a precision. It's a very precision handle. So, we're going to test all three tips that's supplied to see. You get, guys, you get. In the box you get a blade, a curl, and a flat. These are the three that are supplied. We're going to give it a bash. We're going to try out the sharp one, the pointy one first. And we'll check and let you know as no. So we have the actual temperature and we've got the set temperature. It'll, it stays is in sleep mode. As soon as we take it out of the station, it it'll go to working. Mm. Take some lead. It's amazing. Melts. You see, this is really. too much ground. This is ground. So I yeah. Too much heat, and I'm using top pressure. I'm using only, only three hundred. Only three hundred, and it looks like it's real three hundred, yeah. Because other one, I have to put it. I got another T12 alcohol. I have to put it in four hundred to get dust. But this is like that's pure ground. We're gonna test the other tip now. And it's very, very, very light. So basically, it's like you're holding very a pencil. Precise. A normal pencil. There we go. It is only 300. Um, also, let's try another ground pad. It's very nice. Look. Um, like it's very quick to access. Uh, like not like the traditional one. This is like very, very smart. Just something amazing. Really Back to working. It. We're going to try another ground pad. And see what happens. Instantly it's melted. <laughs> Instantly. Wow, bro. You just touch it and the glue melts. Uh, we'll just get some. Wow. <laughs> Off. 
that is one way this is amazing I really enjoy this wow. amazing. let's try the other tips see if we get a different result okay guys we're going to be trying the blade the blade next that comes with the station as you can see no tool that's fine just it's not No, there's no two. Now it's working. We're gonna give it a test on a um flat head one. instant on a heavy crown area let's test it I don't think it does a bad job just sucking it pretty quickly. We'll give the last tip ahead and we'll close the review. This one guys, I'm going to show you, is the curved nozzle that comes with it, as you can see, it's the curved one. Stop. Okay, so working again, we just said that obviously 500 is not the correct temperature, we'd rather always work at 300 to save tip life. Testing. Our normal soldering. Give the that one a test. Instantly sucks it. Instant, 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 guys. So, um, and wicking. On a ground pad is quite nice. <laughs> the whole whole pad comes off. Whole thing. Well done. That. This part we've been removing now requires a very high time pressure and it takes you a good time to do it with iron so for this it's amazing. And this is a heavy ground ground area and we're still able to work it without much hassle compared to other stations. Um,
what's quite nice about this is when you set it to the temp it'll tell you the actual working temperature and set temperature while working you give a thumbs up for this what Thank do you, you guys what do you reckon my, yeah it's a very nice station if someone has a budget like you can afford a gbc but this one to compare it's uh i think it's something is good for microsoft okay. and we're gonna give you more videos as you can watch us so we're gonna see us using it every day then you can compare before you go ahead and buy it if you like it i think i suggest people to buy it it's very nice nice piece to have to store so yeah thanks guys the next video